Hello, everybody, and welcome to my live stream. Today, as you know, I'm inviting everybody to come learn about how to make an isometric game inside of Power Apps. Now, this is a project that I've been working on for at least a, I want to say at least a year. It's gone through multiple versions, though, and I'll walk through some of the history of, of what, has, uh, what I've been making. And in this hour, at least an hour, um, I will show you a couple of the patterns uh, a couple of the patterns that are inside the app so far. Um, and then I'll spend time explaining, you know, what, why does this work this way? Um, what did, what other patterns have I done in the past and why didn't they work? Uh, and I have a second screen where I've got my Twitch pulled up so I can see the chat window. Anytime you have questions, or you want more elaboration on, you know, why why are you doing it this way? Um, I have that up for that. And I know that you're going to have questions. Uh, so please, please chime in. All right. So let me switch over to share my screen now. Um, this here is a work in progress. This is the most complete version. Now it's the, the, uh, the previous version, the, the version before I made some recent enhancements. Um, and the changes that I made recently make it a lot more performant. So let me show you how this works. I can move this character on the screen. Uh, they can move using keyboard controls. They can jump, they can run. And anytime that I go behind one of these obstructions like these, these really dark trees. Now this tree that I'm in, uh, that I'm behind right now is a little bit too short. So it doesn't get opaque, but this other tree is going to cover me and so in a modern video game uh, you you show an opacity you you make it transparent when it's covering you um, the other thing that this character can do is is attack the attack system works uh, but beyond beyond um, fighting the experience system has not been added um, i've not I've not added magic or skills like that. Um, there are buildings, but you can't go inside the buildings yet. Um, so this is where I am right now. It's a lot further than I was a couple months ago. So how does how does developing something like this go? You know, like how much how much time do you get to put into it? Um, this is a weekend project. It is not. Still got some bugs here. Uh, it's not something I, I spend. A lot of time on and many weekends I don't spend on it actually um, so you can see I'm getting hurt here uh, and then so that's that's the conclusion of what I've completed so far if you'd like to see more videos please like and subscribe